Hi guys, welcome to this video looking at what hydrocarbons are. If we start off with the definition then, a hydrocarbon is nice and simply something that is made up of hydrogen and carbon only. Now you can get the fact that it's made up of hydrogen and carbon from the name hydrocarbon, however it's that second part that you need to get in for the second mark which is only. If you don't put the only in you would lose out on a mark in the exam. Now what I mean by that, we've got two different chemicals down below here, CH4 which is also called methane which you can see is made up of hydrogen and carbon only. There is nothing else than hydrogen and carbon in there. So we class that as a hydrocarbon. But if we look at the second chemical, which is methanol, CH3OH, it's made up of hydrogen and carbon, so it meets the first part of our definition, but it's also got an oxygen in there. And the fact that it's got an oxygen means it's not only made up of hydrogen and carbon, therefore it's not a hydrocarbon. So it's really, really important to get that definition in there, the fact that it's only hydrogen and carbon. Okay, let's see what the examiner can ask you on this then. So I've got two questions for you. Number one, nice and simply, methane is an example of a hydrocarbon. What is a hydrocarbon? So two marks, should be nice and easy for you now. And then question two, look at the three substances below, A, B and C, explain which of the three substances is a hydrocarbon. Look at them, give me the definition again, what is a hydrocarbon, which one of those is and why, which of the others aren't and why not. Pause the video, have a go, we'll see how you've done in a minute. Okay, let's have a look at the answer then. So question one says methane is an example of a hydrocarbon. Describe what a hydrocarbon is. As we said, hydro means hydrogen, carbon means carbon. So it's made up of hydrogen and carbon gets you one mark. The second mark is for saying that it's hydrogen and carbon only. And then if we look at substances A, B and C, which one of those is a hydrocarbon? Nice and simply, it's C. So you get one mark for that. Why is it C? Because it's the only one that's made up of hydrogen and carbon only. And then for your third mark, why are A and B not hydrocarbons? Because they contain oxygen, chlorine. They're not just made up of hydrogen and carbon. So any type of description along that line is going to get you your third mark. And that really is it when you're talking about the definition of what a hydrocarbon is. Okay, there is a review question for you which is explain why the substance below is not classed as a hydrocarbon, which should be nice and straightforward for you now. Hi guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please click on like down below. You can also subscribe to get more updates. You can visit the website for more information and you can look at my latest video. Thanks for watching.